has come to our family. So we are back in the Hamlet after a holy crap version <laughs> of level three dungeon. So now we know what the skinny is. I don't even think levels one and two accurately or adequately prepared us for level three. No, maybe not. Level three was stinking nastiness, especially with this dude given us stress every time an unholy person is spawned. That is wicked. Yeah. So, we're back in the hamlet. We only got one experience point from this one dark room here. So, uh, I guess we'll go ahead and hand that out to everyone. I think I already did, didn't I? I don't th think so, because I only have a five over here. So, if you had given me one, I, I would have an extra. I gave one to, I gave one to myself. Oh, to my I people. I see how it is. <laughs> I, I see how it goes. Years, you didn't want it. Yeah, that's probably true. He was right. too busy being hopeless. All right, so we got 57 <clears throat> gold. 57 gold. All right. That's not bad. All right, so the uh, prophet is going to make sure that the tavern recovers minus three. So even though we have an upgraded tavern two here, um, if we, we would normally heal nine stress for nine gold, but with the, the, uh, I keep forgetting his name, the prophet, the prophet. Yep. it's going to be six <clears throat> stress for nine gold or three, three, three stress for three and going to pay one is not even worth it. No. Nope. So there's that. You need to turn in your afflictions. Uh, okay. You want to do that first before we do a lot of that stuff. Okay. So we turn in the affliction. This flips back over to this, but stays there. Yep. And, uh, and get negative quirk. Negative quirk coming up. For this guy too. So oh yeah, I know. Off oh. guard. So every time I crit, no, every time I take damage is plus one damage, stress. Oh, that's horrible. And this guy flips over, and we take uh, negative quirk. And this is nervous. Every time I take stress, I take an additional stress. Well, at least it doesn't say every time the Crusader takes stress, you get stress. <laughs> yeah. But every time you evade, you lose a stress, which you did evade. So is this every time I take damage? Yes. I get plus one stress? Yeah, I would have to say that wow. that's... Wow. That makes sense, right? Because I'm off yeah. guard, so... Yeah. Yep. Okay. Okay. All right, so here... The Come on, be something good. Uh, medical breakthrough. Medical Doesn't sound too bad. We get three. Games. Even maladies can be defeated by the power of the human mind. What about darkness, though? <laughs> <laughs> the party removes a disease from a hero. One hero loses a disease. Uh, definitely. <laughs> you yeah. want my tapeworm? <laughs> Give it yeah, up. Get rid of that tapeworm. That's three days, and that's it. Nice. Right. That's not so. That's good. Not so bad. Not so bad. Three at days. All. So. Rock and roll, you lead the way. All right, so what do you think? You know, we did a little bit of uh, talking in between the last video and this one. So trying to figure out how we're going to handle getting through level three. Right. And actually getting to and facing off with the Prophet. Um, I'm wondering if we... Well, we're going to burn a day to get your stress relief for everybody. Yeah. But I mean, 
we can do that now with the Mm -hmm. with uh, the uh, zealous speech with the crusader, and that'll take a full day. That'll that'll burn a full day. But um, it's minus five stress for everybody. I know. So that's I think that's worth it at this point compared to what we're going to lose here. Yeah, because I mean we're we're paying more for less. So. Let's just go ahead and lose one day. He makes his speech, and we all lose five. Two, three, four, five. He goes back to one. Yep. Uh, back to zero here. It gives us two days. We definitely want people to um, try to level up. Yeah. Did clarify that that doesn't change the guilt, so it's... Yes, yes. Okay, so this is for the... He's going to block the... Nomad wagon, like nomads. he always does. He nomads. really hangs out with the nomads. Yeah, he does all the time. All right, so practical alternative to work. You guys are healed up because you did the crazy room in the last one. Yes, we did. We're all healed up, so we don't need to heal. Um, I mean, you guys you know. are looking pretty good too, except for the grave robber has some damage. Yeah. Hmm. So you guys got corks. I do. We need to buy some of this, and we need to get at least two people to upgrade. Well, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go here to the abbey and uh, spend two bucks to remove one cork. So I'll spend two bucks here to remove this off guard because that's that seems like it's a pretty nasty card. Yeah. <clears throat> um, the highwaymen, however. Um, Provide some provisions, or did he upgrade last time? He did not upgrade last time. He's got quite he did. a bit. He he upgraded his wicked slice. Gotcha. He upgraded his wicked slice. So I think I'd like to upgrade her skills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he's good with. I think them, we'll really, go over here and buy some provisions. Two. Yep. So that's three bucks. Okay. Then she's gonna go over here. And spend one, two, three, four to upgrade two of these guys. <clears throat> okay. That's what she's going to do. I'll do that in a second. Yeah, that's one thing that we've been um, kind of whiffing on. We've been not the, upgrading the, the as much the guild, as we could. <clears throat> every time you visit the guild, you can, up, you, you can upgrade twice. Mm-hmm. So you can do two things. You can upgrade a level one hero, and you can upgrade uh, your skill. Or you can do two skills, yeah. or uh, what have you. So... That's a pretty cool thing. And there is no upgrade. We were talking about this earlier. There, The, the guild is never upgraded. Uh, yeah. It stays the same throughout the entire tar- the entirety of the uh, trip. So that's pretty cool. Um, <clears throat> and then for the Vestal, I think she's going to go here like she did last time. She's going to heal everybody one more stress. Oh, okay. So we can go in with some stress and she's going to give everybody a buff for three turns. Yeah, yeah. So I that got, was pretty helpful in that first. I yeah. wonder if we would have survived without those. I don't know. I got enough bugs. for one of those over here if you want to get yeah, the rest yeah, yeah. of them okay. out. But. And then I am going to upgrade my poison dart because I really like the poison dart. It is pretty nasty. And then I'm going to upgrade flashing daggers to two with those upgrades. And that will be. That will be that day. These aren't in very good order, but. All right, so that cooks down to our last day. Yep. Um. <clears throat> all right, he's all upgraded to level two stuff. I'd like to get maybe his grave shop blast up to two. Okay. Um, this guy's gonna go to the graveyard. <laughs> it's the only two places he goes. Wow. He just loves hanging out. I think he's just. Not I wonder if I should work. get. That's that means every time I get stressed, I get too stressed. Yep. So and every I, time an unholy comes out, you're gonna get a stress. You know, <clears throat> I need to go ahead and get rid of that too. So um, that is here. Yep. Uh, now, do I remove? If I remove two quirks, I have to remove both of them. No, nope, you can just remove. You can just pay to remove one quirk. Okay, the other one's a good one. So yeah. Uh, so that's two. Yep. And then the Crusader. 
I don't know, should, should the Crusader go up to three, level three? Um, he could. He tanks a lot. Yeah, I'd have to find his card, though. <laughs> um, I don't know where they are. Actually, I know where they are. They're in the box. Yeah, they are. Yeah. Um, that means I spend four bucks. Or I could run experience. up a couple of these Vestals things if you don't want to. It's up to you. Well, I think we're going to... Uh, I will save it. I think we're... Uh, I'm... I'm thinking we should do what we talked about. But try, we'll to, try to try, try to game the system the a little bit without doing a little too much. Yeah, go through the next uh, quest without uh, doing a whole lot of stuff. You know, take a hit on our experience, come back, and then take another trip. Kind of level up. Yeah, I think next. I think that makes sense for the next one. I don't yeah, know if that'll affect us long term and going to the darkest, but yeah, we'll see. Right. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, but. All right, so um, I think what he'll do is, um, uh, what are we talking about? We're not gonna... leveling him up. Um, if we're going to do that, we should upgrade the center. Uh, nah, save area. our money, because we're not going to get a whole lot of money if, if no, we, that's true. If that's we shortchange true. it. Yeah, yeah. Let's save our money um, yep. as much as we can. I don't know if we want to buy too much stuff then either. Right. If that's the case, I'll have her come here. And draw one of those chests. He can't. Uh, which one? Anyone. They all look the same to me. Right. Get a free dice on the face of your choice. Yep. No. All right. Um. Well, no matter at that point, somebody's. Do you want her to level up? Yeah. She probably needs to. Um. Maybe just get more provisions. Yeah, unless we don't think we're going to go very deep, then we're just wasting. Oh money. yeah, that's true. That's true. Mm. So just not do anything. That Maybe. seems weird. I know well, it's possible. Maybe you can get rid of this. Oh, yeah. you Two bucks. Get rid of that. Um, yeah. Two bucks. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Get rid of the disease. Trying to. Yeah, it's true. I mean, with all of the stress that that guy gives, this gives us a pretty good chance of. Trying to beef up quick. Mm-hmm. Because every time one of those unholy people uh, show up, we, we, we take a hit with stress. Yep. On top of all the other stress that we're taking already. We might get a good roll in dungeon, too. So. Yeah, maybe. We'll see. Okay. We'll see. All right, so that's it. So that's it. Dink. We are headed back to level three. All right, they are back. Tricerator will never rest, even unto death. We have three objective rooms. Each one has a bone captain in it with plus 20 life. What? And plus two dodge. What? <laughs> Yeah, Are so, you crazy? Yeah, a little bit. How much does the Bone Captain have her anyways? Bone Captain has 33 normally, so, that's so he's got three and, 53 and three life. dodge. And what? That's crazy talk. One, two, three. One, two. Oops, I did that wrong. Was oh, wrong. man. Two of those. Three of these. No, you only got one. One of these. Did I get two? Yeah. Oh. Two, oh. two traps. I picked that up on accident. Yeah. And a torch. Empty. And a dark room. Okay. There you go. <sighs> Maybe it really is worth skipping. Man, that is nastiness, dude. So there's three of those rooms with three of those bone captains. We're trying to take out their leaders. Okay, so explain how this works. We have to go into at least one room, or can we just say, screw that? No, it says, uh, no, unless it says that we have to do, huh? There's no, there's no minimum requirement on this one. Some have that. Yeah. We had that one that did, but I don't, this one doesn't have a minimum requirement. 
Okay, so I could be just putting this out here for nothing. You could be. Because we could really just say... really want to not do it. Well, what do you think? Is that a good idea? I think it's a good idea. Because be we got our idea. butts reamed in the first one. My brain says get a little money and find one, <laughs> but I know that's probably not the smartest thing. So I'm I am totally in agreement that we could. We do have a camp of eight, though. Well, let's check out what the first one is and see if it's one of those rooms. If it's one of those rooms, we try to do it and then leave. Yep. Or uh, something that's not. No, we still need to roll these out. Okay. Well. Good night. Let's Good just night. check. You bought two extras anyways. I did. And I get a free one to be whatever we want afterwards. So we got a couple torches. A couple shovels. A couple antidotes. Did I flip my torch? Oh no, there it is. Yeah. yeah. Torches, I just added another torch, a couple shovels, three antidotes, which are stress relief, and a bandage and food. I think we're good. Oh, should we see what it is? Yeah, let's see. Empty room. Which happens what? With nothing. We just walk down and it doesn't we do We still anything. have to roll the dice. We still have to roll the dice to walk there. All right, let's go. Hi, Crusader. Hi, Wiggle. Oof. Okay. So we're okay between the two, <coughs> between these two. Losing one light, we kind of like that, right? Yeah. And losing a torch. Yeah. That's good. And these two losing two shovels. Yep. See what we come up with. Cood cood. So bloop bloop. We are here. We remove that. Yep. And now we, we can get to see two rooms. Yeah. Let's scout. Oh wait, I didn't do the first one. We didn't take I don't think I did either. We didn't take stress on that first uh, one. Was she at zero? I don't know. Maybe I did. Maybe I, I, I did. know I know the highwayman was and, and he was still sitting at zero. Alright, that's fine. So blink. There's the dark room. And we don't want that one. Come and on. there's an objective room. Alright, that's one fight. One fight, one, one experience. fight and we'll get one experience. So one bone captain's gonna come in. Mm -hmm. So we know that only three guys are coming in here. That's right. The bone captain and two others. <clears throat> bone saw is ready. Where did that thing go? Got the bone captain for three minutes. Right there. Three minutes of playtime. Plus twenty life and plus two dodge. Oh, he's gonna go down. Okay. He's gonna go down. I got my second wind. Look at this. Crusader is about to knock his block off. Alright. Let's let's go exploring then. Oh, no. Right down the corridor. Crusader. Oh come on. Oh that stupid darkness. Look at that. High wind. We got darkness everywhere. I gotta so, eat me some food. And two some torches. Dark, darkness for food. two torches. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. And I get this guy, which is too stressed, too damage, and I can't do anything about it. Alright, whose idea was this? Grave robbers. <laughs> Grave robbers, yep. Yeah. Sweet, she's gonna eat a couple of these antidotes to knock her stress out. Maybe. You can go ahead. <laughs> we might. Alright, so On first... On the way out, at least. Uh -huh. Watch, we're gonna get tore So we gotta off. spawn him first. Yeah, in objective room, spawn a bone captain who has 20 life and plus 20 life and plus two dodge. Man, so he's, he's got three dodge, dodge for days. and 53 life. All right. I did shuffle these, but I'll cut them anyways. Are you kidding me? Oh, jeez, Louise, a stupid bone bearer again. And the... What? <laughs> Why did you cut it? Oh. Can I uncut it? No. Uh. 
Oh, gee. So, level three bone bear. So, he wants to go last, right? Uh huh. Oh, Holy crap. Louise. Whose idea was that? Well, my idea. <laughs> Was to take it easy. Who, who cut the deck? Whoever cut the, the other guy. The freaking deck had other things in mind. Wow. Holy crud nuggets. Well, nobody can say that level three dead. wasn't tough. Oh, come on. 53, 70. 17. That's 100 damage we have to do. Seems reasonable. <laughs> I've got to do 151 soon. Well, yeah, I guess. Man, oh man, there you go. Tomb of the Ancients. Tomb of the Ancients. Okay, here we go. Uh, All right, so that we was got... the worst cut in history. Oh my gosh, wasn't it? Ancestors' glory. Right, so Heroes standing in the green here are immune to blight, bleed, debuffs, stuns, marks, or pushes. And so here we are safe from. All negative effects. Here and... Just us. Yeah, well, that's where this dude's standing. Sweet. Let's rush him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh, this goes here. And then... There's another chest there. Another chest up there. Wow. Another chest here. All right, my bad. Wow, how did I do that? Christmas. Alright. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Holy moly. This was not a good idea. This was a bad idea. Hang on, let me get rid of all of those. This is a bad idea. 73 health with 3 dodge. No, 53 health. Oh, 53 health with 3 dodge, sorry. We'll make it worse than it already is. No armor. He doesn't need it with three dodge. I know. They, they all have three dodge. <gasps> oh. They're all equally as dodgy. We are going to die. All right. Now all we gotta do is stay off of death's door <laughs> and let the bad guy go first. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So he wants to, what'd you roll? Six. Uh, he wants to do a number one. Yeah. Crushing blow to the closest, and he wants to be one away. Mm -hmm. And he can move one. So. Right to the Crusader. Boom. Crit chance three. I don't want to run. Accuracy ten. <clears throat> Accuracy eight, sorry. Accuracy eight. Crit chance three. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. Okay. Alright, just a regular hit, thankfully. For so 11, 11 damage. damage. <laughs> oh my god. And you're immune to push. Or you're resistant to push, so nothing there. 11 damage. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, Crusader's next. Alright, well, the good thing is, is, I can hold my own against that. But he has more hit points than I do, so... Um, oh, dude, I'm all by myself over here. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to rush that center guy, because if he does that heal on the most wounded guy... Oh, my goodness, you're correct. I'm using my speed stone. If he heals that guy of... 46 damage. <laughs> We're going to heal. Cry. <laughs> I'm healing. I'm using my speed stone to give myself two movement to go over here. And I'm going to smack that guy with um, just a zealous accusation. That's all I can hit with him. You have been accused. One space all right. So accuracy so, seven, crit one. Uh, crit two. Uh. It. Wait. Oh yeah. Missed. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna lose one of these. 
Oh yeah, crit two, huh? Okay. All right, so the brigand goes next with an eight. Oh, no, he just goes by, he doesn't even need to roll. He just wants to do a one. He wants to do a one. And I can't even say something fire. Blanket fire against no. the most crowded room. Well, there no. happens to be three of us. He wants to be two spaces away. So crit chance is two. His normal accuracy is ten, depending. So you want to roll it? He's going to shoot all three of them. An eight. So his accuracy is ten. So that hits the Vestal. It hits her. And it hits me too. Hits everybody. Yeah. Okay. Damage five. Oof. Each. You got another five? I don't need a five. I got eleven. Oh boy. A debuff of two on each of them, and it raises everybody's stress by one. Or each of those threes by one. Not the Crusader. Didn't hit no, the Crusader. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I'm just. Wow. All right. Shots fired. No. <laughs> you think? How in the heck did I pull those guys? Oh. I can't believe I cut that like that. That's I know. Amazing. Okay. Where's my... Here we go. Highwayman is next. Highwayman. <clears throat> Are we focusing on the, on the... I think we have to. The, the bone dude? Mm-hmm. Okay. Unless we want to cut this guy down quick. How many? How many he's at 17. 17. Oh my. Got plenty of damage. Uh, but he can bleed, right? Yeah, this guy just buffs and heals. No, he's, he's resistant huh? to he's it. resistant to bleed. So I'll take one if I open vein him. So we cut him down first. Um. I'll move one, two. You can do ranged attacks on him, right? Hmm? You can do ranged attacks on him because it's full up. I can do ranged attacks on him, yes. Okay. Um, so I'm going to open vein. It's uh, accuracy 11. So um, accuracy 8, crit. Crit chance two. Uh, 2. And you lose one of those debuffs, too. Yeah. That's a one. I actually take one less debuff there. That's a one. That's, That's a crit. That's a one. That's a crit. You get a stress so, heal. Stress heal one. And that's uh, 12. Woo! Damage. Um, should I use my damage stone? Give him 15? I mean, you got 17? Yeah. I mean, it's not going to kill him, but... Mm, well, we can leave him alone because he's going to bleed, right? Uh, he does get uh, two, yeah. So... That way you can just start, yes, I'm going to use this. So that's three more damage, and then he'll bleed out at the beginning of his next turn. Okay. That was a big hit. What's the bleed? Two for two? Hmm? Two for two on the bleed? Uh, two for three. Minus his resistance? Yes. Two for two, correct. Okay. Well, that was good. Oh that's one, one of the three down. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, Robert's turn. So Grave Robber is going to not immune to... He is resistant to stun and okay. immune to bleed. Alright, so I'm going to throw Poison Dart first. Accuracy is 12, so accuracy is 9. Crit chance is 4. Crit chance 4, accuracy 9. Come on, that was a 4. Was cool, a take it. Okay, so both of these guys get a reduction. Mm -hmm. um, five damage. I don't have a five. Okay. Five damage but on the bone bear. Four blight for three turns. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> right? Not so bad? Yeah. All right, now I'm going to throw a dagger at it. Accuracy is ten, so accuracy is seven. Crit chance four again. Well, it's a hit for eight damage. Oof, I got it. 
A eight damage, that's gonna turn into uh, 13. Yep. And that's her turn. Okay. What's so his turn? That was a mess of damage, man. It's his turn, he's gonna blight for four. And then I cannot read his card, but he wants to do. I rolled a three. Rolled a three. He's in the last place. So a three is one. So he needs to do a uh, a wicked surge against the most crowded spot. Against the most crowded spot, and he wants to be two away. Which and it is. basically gives us no. Oh, wicked surge is a buff. To his most crowded enemy. Oh. And it would be to this guy since he's in the front of the... So it gives him two buff? Yep. Yep, that's right. Snap. Okay. Snap. Well, Snap. Could have been worse. Yeah. Vestal's turn. So the Vestal is going to... No, I cannot stun that guy. Right, he's immune to stun. Who? No, he's resistant. He's to resistant stun. to it. So that won't do me much good. Oh, dazzling light doesn't give you two. No, that's why I said it should give you two. Ah. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and I don't want to move and waste it. I'm gonna just heal. I'm gonna be reserved here. I'm gonna heal. The Grave Robber with Divine Grace, crit chance of, I just took one of those off, so crit mm. chance of 5, accuracy is 16, so. Got it. So there's that. It's one more stress relief each. And she heals 9. Oof. Okay, so that was her first one. And second one... I guess I really don't need to heal her again. Range of two, I'll use judgment. Yeah, judge that do. sucker. I am judging you. I got my my uh, Judge Judy robes on. <laughs> this is Judge Judy when she was 26. <laughs> Best I got. <laughs> Crit chance three, <laughs> accuracy seven. We got. Okay. That's five damage, and I heal myself for three. Five damage on him? On the... On yep. the, uh... On, the, on this dude? Yes, sir. Five damage, so... Up to 22. Out of what? 30. All right. Okay. That is our turn. That wasn't... Boy, oh boy. Round two. Boy, oh boy. I gotta go get that chest while it's there. <laughs> <laughs> Man, we gotta get out of here with our lives intact, bro. A little bit of money. <laughs> <laughs> See, now you know why I can't play Gloomhaven. <laughs> so chase the money all day. Alright, here we go. Crusaders first. Okay. Crusader! So he's at 22. He's gonna take four more on his turn, so that puts him in. So he needs four damage to. He needs four damage? Finalize him. To finalize him. So. Although he's not going to go first, so somebody else will probably go before. You don't have to focus him down, but. Well, um. Should I go after him then? Start working on him? Yeah. Two people can be in there. Um, he's unholy. These trinkets, I have to use them before a roll or after a roll? Before. Before. Trying to add your crit transfer? Yeah. Just do it. I mean, that'll be an opening round salvo, you know? Mm hmm I'm already getting two, so it'll be crit six. Yep. So... Crit six, accuracy seven. Ugh. That's a small window. 
and plus two against Ho Unholy. That's 18 damage if you hit him. I know. That's crazy. Which means I probably won't. Come on now. All right, here we go. So I am definitely using my Warrior's Ring, and that's giving me plus four, five, and because of our light, six. So accuracy six, I'm sorry, accuracy seven, crit six. <laughs> Eat the Crusader. No, Didn't I tell you? <laughs> Didn't I freaking tell you? <sighs> All right. Highway man, you can do something better than that, I hope. Crawl in the corner and die? <laughs> yes. Uh, so the brigand is about to die when he when he takes an action, yeah, right? As soon as he, yeah, as soon as his turn, he's out. Um, and he's gonna bleed out when he does. No, no, he needs four more damage. He needs four more damage. But I should go ahead and maybe take care of him then. Yeah, might as well get over there to start pre prepping One, two. to shoot, anyways. One, two, and. I'm immune to all that stuff while I'm in here, mm -hmm. so that's good. So you lose the debuff. Uh, oh yeah, lose the debuff. Plus one crit. Um, so we'll go ahead and do pistol shot from here over here. Oh, okay. Because we don't need to worry about this guy. Oh, no, 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 we do, we do, we do. Never mind, never mind, you're right. So, uh... If you miss, I'll have to try to make it happen, so... Um, all right, I'll just do, I'll do Wicked Slice. Because I'm in there, it's the... When Vayne's accuracy 11. Yeah, that's true. I only need four damage, so... It doesn't matter about yeah, the Yeah, let's go with the 11. So, so eight. it's eight... And two. Crit two. Oops. <laughs> what? I don't know. In the world! It, he wants us to fail. I don't want... <laughs> uh, dice oh, hate uh, me. All right. Big Daddy's turn. No, it's the brigand. Huh? It's the brigand. Oh, no, no, no. He, he hasn't gone yet. He hasn't gone oh, yet. Oh, crud. Nuggets. All right. So he gets plus one crit. So he's got two crit plus whatever. Well, depends on what he wants to do. He wants to do a. I rolled a four. So he wants to do a one. He wants to do a crushing blow. So it's crit so four. The closest. He needs to move one space though. So we need to decide: is he going to come here? Yeah. So he's closer to everybody to hit him. Or we can put him out here, but we no, don't want to chase do him that. down. No, let's just do that. Okay, so against the Crusader. Crit chance 4, accuracy 8. You quit it. Uh. <laughs> Alright, so accuracy, that's 11 damage. That's straight up 11 damage. No push because of your resistance. At 22. Alright, Grave Robber's turn. So I was going to have her move, but I need to hit this guy. So he needs. Oh, it doesn't matter. Alright, I'm going to throw Poison Dart. Um, accuracy's <laughs> just 9. Please, just please hit him. Accuracy's 9 modified. Do what I could not do. <laughs> I need a 9. Okay. And. Don't chances, be distracted by chances four. a stupid flag. All right, there's an eight. So he's going to take three damage, which isn't enough, except for that it gives him another stack of these. Which so, means that he will It means blank he's up. gone, yes. Yeah. Got it. He will blight out. Okay, so that's her first move. Mm -hmm. This guy's going to die. That, that one's going to die. die. So... Well, we are still in round two. All right. um, well, does he have any crowded rooms? He does have a crowded room attack with a bunch of... So I don't really want to crowd up, so I'm just going to move there so I can be within range, and that's it. Okay. All right. 
So this he guy's gonna die. Out. Yep. No, not him. This dude. Nope. He's not next. This guy's next. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Got it, got it, got it, got it. I can't, I just want that guy to die I so know. badly. You want him off the board. I want him to die. Uh, okay, well, he's gone. Oh, oh dad gone. See, he's still causing trouble, even after he's dead. I'll put him at the bottom just so I don't cut. Don't <laughs> let me cut that close. Okay, next guy's turn. He's out too. Yeah. Go ahead. Fix all that. Get out of here, you stupid. That was good damage. Although we haven't hurt that guy yet, but it would have been brutal if he could have healed him. Well, I know. So. That's the thing. All right, so the Vestal's the only one left. Yeah, I can't she's, believe I missed on both of my attacks. She's pretty far away, so... Oh, let's go ahead and get that out of there. She doesn't need to heal there. Wish she had some speed. She doesn't have... That shouldn't she be a repost, a... should it? What's that? That should be a buff. Right? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Um... Really, all she's got, she's got move. Oh, if she moves here, that's range two. So she can do a judgment on him at range two. Judge that person! So, crit chance. Crit chance three, accuracy seven. Yes! There's a crit. She gets stress relief. She gets another stress relief. That's ten damage. Yes! Straight up, just 10. So now he's at 43. 43, three dodge. All righty. Round tray. We've got two rounds to dispatch this fellow. Uh -huh. I think we can do it. As long as you stop missing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I need to start hitting and oh, stop so missing when he's hitting us. Oh, yeah, okay. That's what I need to do. All right, but here I we go. I cannot guarantee you can borrow my this will happen. Stone. Crusaders first. All right, so how does this uh, Warrior's Ring work? It says accuracy minus two if not in the aggressive stance, but I am in the aggressive so you stance. you have to get out of the aggressive stance. Seriously? And use it. Really? Flip it over, yeah. Oh, wow. See, I thought that was going to be cooler than that. No, well, you got to get out of the aggressive stance, I think. Use it. Wow. <clears throat> that would give him <laughs> no um I would be throwing my attack away again mm -hmm. if I did that um so I am going to everybody else has ranged attacks right yep so I'm just going to go in here and start smiting him all right, smash. Is he immune to stun? Oh, he's, yeah, no, he's resistant to it. He's, re uh, he's resistant to push. He's immune to stun and bleed. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so stunning blow doesn't do any good. No. Nope. All right, but unholy does. So. Crit chance one. Uh, crit chance oh, two. one, two. Nice. Accuracy Six. seven. Got him. Boom. So that's 11 damage. Well, that ain't so bad. Mm -mm. So. Oh, yeah, because he's in holes. Nice. That's, um, wait, did I move? Yep. You did, you walked forward. Oh, that's right, I was here. He moved out, and then I came in, yeah. All right, highwayman. Um, Highwayman. Oh, he's immune to bleed, right? Mm hmm. Uh, he can't move in there, so. We cheated. Why? One, two, two unholy. We should have each taken two stress at the beginning of the round. Okay, so one, two. Not one, cheated, two. but. There we go. Okay. Um. Yeah, just pistol shot, I guess. Um, accuracy 10. 
open vein would be better, but I can't get in there, so mm -hmm. we'll just do a pistol shot. Accuracy 10, crit 3. Accuracy 7. Or accuracy 7. Accuracy three. 7, crit 3. Okay, that's a hit. So it's 7 more damage. Nice. 28. One more attack. And then, um, Grape Shot? Yeah, might as well. That's all you got for range. Yeah. It's going to be a measly accuracy 5, though. Yeah, but it's going to give him a debuff for 1 and give everybody else an extra crit. Well, possibly. That was a 1, dude. <laughs> oh, no, well, yeah. It was a 1, and then it rolled. It was a 5 and a 2 and a 7 before the 1. But it was a 1. <laughs> yep, it was. That's a miss. Yep. Okay. It's a miss. Great Robert's turn. <clears throat> and he is not immune to blight, just so we know. Crit chance four. Accuracy nine. Got him. Okay. It's only three damage. But. And he gets that stack of blight. One, two, three. Read them and weep there, bony. <laughs> okay, that's the first one. Second one is a dagger throw, crit chance four, accuracy seven. Yes! That's a crit. Let's go down again. Let's go down again. See, we're just here for show. <laughs> You're actually and getting the job is done. 12 damage. 12 damage. I got it. All right. It's 43. 43 out of his 53? Yep. All right. Ten more damage on him. Well, six more damage because of that blight. Mm -hmm. Okay. That was Grave Robber's turn. Best will get to go next. So, healing. Yeah. Right? Should yeah. I try to take him out or how much more do he need? Ten? She needs to do six. She can't do six reliably, not without a crit. Okay. I'm going to go here. I'm going to divine some grace. Healing. So, crit chance five. That's a one. Yeah. So, he gets a stress is, relief. See, you're sucking up all the, <laughs> all 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 the crit lights. aura. Is that what's happening? All right. Well, he gets a stress relief. Bandit, er, Who does? Highwayman. Highwayman. And then he heals nine health. Nine health. Okay. Guess who goes last? We'll take it. I'll get rid of one of these. One of those. We'll put a five out there. You got a five? Yeah. Got it. Okay. Is that 47? Right on. So he gets plus one crit, plus two crit. And he wants to do a one. He wants to do a crushing, crushing blow. blow. Against him, but he doesn't want to be in the same. Sp oh, yeah, closest, but he doesn't want to be in the same space. So we either got to move him out or we got to move him in here. Does he fit? He fits. Um, but I won't be able to get in there and and do. No, you can zealously use him, but I you could. Be, you could do that and heal. You it's do not that? the worst thing in the world. Yeah. Okay. Here you go. Crit chance. Four. Accuracy ten. Why do I have to roll it? Pop his smurf. <laughs> hey! I don't want to be the one that kills your dude off. What happened? You took eleven damage. No. Yeah. Nine. Yeah. Crit Seven. Chance is eleven. He's attacking this guy. Why is he attacking him? Because that's what he wants. He wants oh. the closest. And he wants to be one space away. Crusader gets eleven damage. I really don't like that, dude. <laughs> just 11, 11, 11. No, right? <laughs> I can do the same thing, but I am at death's door. Again. I thought you were at... <laughs> I have the most 
health in this entire group, and I am consistently at death's door. You need armor. One dodge. I should not be running around a dungeon in my tunic. That is correct. <laughs> oh, I don't know to tell you. <laughs> All right, we're on round three. And if he gets to go first. No, round three? I thought it was round four now. Well, we round, were in I round three. You did? Mm -hmm. mm. Our first round. If he goes first, he's dead. No, he's not. 43. 47. 47. Plus four. Oh, yeah. Stupid. <laughs> Man, don't let him go first. I, so you want to pick? Give him, a, give me the card. Just pick one Just, of those. No, give me the card. <laughs> you gotta, your unholiness over mm -hmm. there is messing us up. Mm -hmm. Now watch, it's gonna be him. I'm not gonna be able to do anything about it, and I'll have to shut up. I can't roll crits. I can't even hit the stupid behemoth of a person that's standing on top of a sarcophagus. He's covered in armor from head to toe only thing his is teeth there no wait no, wait. no, no this is the top <laughs> so you know there's only a 25 percent chance okay here goes first my goodness all right i'm going to um zealously accuse this fellow of being a troublemaker mm. and stinking <laughs> That's a miss. Right? Yes. Alright, you can do it again. No! You didn't hear me! You are foul! Six. Ten, accuracy That's three. That's a hit. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, it's a hit. Six damage? Six damage. Think, 53. Right? 53. Well, then he's dead. Oh. Look at that. 53, he's dead. Okay. Easy money. Should we scout and see if we can do it again? No! Pretty please. No! <laughs> Alright. I am... <laughs> I am literally dragging through the halls at this point. Okay, it is but time. before we leave, we're in the room. We got yes. our one experience point each. Yes, we do. I don't know why I just threw that at you. Because. And we need one for town, too, which I'll give it later. But now we have these to spend. So we can heal up two for somebody. We can also stress heal three if we're leaving. Yeah. Well, and. He has the most hits, right? So I'll heal him for two with those two bandages. And then. Actually, stress isn't too bad. I'll take two, you take one. Sure. Okay, and then number two is we have a camp we can for eight. Camp! Yay! Um, do it all. So I'll go back to camp of fourteen. Yeah. You have to mitigate it somehow. Somehow. Well, it's stuff we don't have to. We don't have to buy in camp in, in town. All right, back to the hamlet. Re turn and tail and running. <laughs> All right, here we go. Unsettling darkness. <laughs> when darkness forms shapes on the horizon, making all candle lights dim. This was one such week, one unsettling darkness. So our next dungeon, we start at oh, four. Didn't we get ten bucks from going in there anyway? Yep. Shouldn't we have? Mm-hmm. All right. Whoever the money man is. That was you. All right. Oh, wait. Okay. So anyways, we start, our torch starts at level four next time. Oh. Not too bad. Just cuts it down just a little bit. That sucks, though. We had three days. Yep. All right. Alrighty. What is the order of the day? You need some healing. We need some leveling. Be nice to get some level threes, maybe. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So All right. So we need to put this guy. 
<laughs> I don't know. All right, I'm going to send the Crusader. See, the only to get... zeros I roll is when I'm in town for that guy. I'm going to send the Crusader to get 10 heal, so. It still has four. Okay, how much that cost? Um, Three bucks. I got it. All right. I'm about the Highwayman. The Highwayman. Um, he's feeling good on stress. Um, we're all pretty good on health and stress isn't bad. Yeah. So we'll go in with some gear. Shoot. And like I said, leveling some people up. We have no negative quirks right now. Wow. No. Well, we again yeah, we, no, we did good. That was a <clears throat> smart move. Okay, so can he go to the uh, guild first then? Mm hmm. And uh, I'll go to the guild and he can upgrade two things. So should it be up to level three and then one of these things up to level one? Uh, level three? Yeah, might as well. And you're also going to get a fifth skill. Right. To slot. So. So that's going to be. Um, five experience and six coin. Five experience. Well, yeah, here. And four comes back. You gave me six experience. Huh? You gave me six. I thought it was what you said. No, five. Oh, okay. Not bad. Um, you gotta get four. Yep. I like it. And he needs his level three self. Yep. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Go ahead. So for these two... I think I'm going to do Old Faithful with this one. I'm going to go here, give us all a stress relief, and a buff of three to start the next match. The next dungeon. So if you want to hand everybody a buff of three. Okay. This dude's rocking and rolling too. He's got 22 hit points. He can nice. move three. Has resistances to stun, bleed, and blight. And three dodge. And three dodge, baby. Yeah. Does it upgrade this too? No. no. Same so far. Okay. All right. So last person for this day is a grave robber. She can't go here. She can't go there. I can get an <coughs> item, but I think I'm just going to go here. Spend three. And get two extra dice. Anyways, okay, that's day three. Everybody comes back. All right. Groundskeeper goes to four this time. No sanitarium. No sanitarium. Dang. Well, I, we weren't really needing it anyway. We weren't really healing. Uh, we could, but okay. I think I'm gonna send a crusader. Oh, I still need to pull another one of these things mm -hmm. and upgrade one of those. Yep. So we're going to have to do that for a little bit. I'm going to send him here. It's five experience. And Same thing. Six bucks, yeah. Right? Yep. Um, Maybe we'll, we'll just leave the Vestal back at level two. Anybody else leveled three? Really? Mm -hmm. Why would you though? She does a pretty good job healing right now. Well, but yeah, she does. It's, it's the damage and really doing some damage that's. I think that'd be more important. Okay, so you're going there. Crusader is buff. He Good. still is only still slow as everything though. He can only he still can only move one. No, he's got a dodge of two. He's got a dodge of two, though, yeah. Now. Okay. So you get a new skill for each of those. He's still got to level up his skill. Both of them do now, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Both of them do. All right. So I can st I, I can start doing that while you work on other things. So What do we got left? Because I'm going to upgrade one of these things as Three, well. Six. We spent those on something, right? Yeah, we did. Hmm? We spent these on three of those last time. Okay. Um, 
What's the bandit? What's he gonna do? Why don't he buff himself for six turns? Oh, well, you guys, you still don't have buffs yet. Go ahead. Oh, that's what right. I need, I need, uh, what was it, two? Two buffs for three. Three each. Man, I'm liking that smite three. Uh, damage. 19. 19 for crit, 11. and then 14 versus hey, unholy. you give me the 11 guy. 11, 11 That's guy. right. <laughs> uh, I am going to do that, though. I don't know exactly. Now, if I change, like, for example, if I upgrade smite 2 to smite 3, mm -hmm. um, the next one I start with still has to be level 1? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, so you just get a... Well, unless you already have that skill upgraded, because the truth is you could... Upgrade a skill to two. Like technically, when you do this, you're going to get rid of all the. You're going to only keep the seven cards that you have. Right. Like current. Yeah. Like when you play it, because you could upgrade more than, you know, yeah. three or four, and you could swap them out as you need them. So. Mm -hmm. But if you ha if you don't have an upgraded item that, or another upgraded skill, then it's going to be a level one skill, that comes out. So I upgraded Smite 2 to Smite 3. Mm -hmm. And you upgraded his level. So so you get a level 1 skill here and a level 1 skill there, basically. Yeah. Alright. Um. I don't have a whole heck of a lot, but it's, it's 8 gold to buy a trinket, and I just don't know. I'll do Holy Lance. Just in case he ever gets Just in case he gets knocked back, game. that's good. All right. Um, so that's him. This guy. I I did the same thing with him, so I need to upgrade something. Mm -hmm. I need to upgrade. What do you think? Pistol shot. Yeah. Yeah, I think that'd be good. The big one upgrade pistol, pistol shot, shot three, and nine, and fifteen. Mm -hmm. One to two away. Yep. Do you have anything? You don't have any skills you can put in there that mark stuff, do you? Uh, no, it doesn't. That's the thing that I. He he. That's one of the ways that he synergizes with other characters, uh, but he doesn't have anything that gives a mark. He's got a tracking shot, which you would think gives people a mark, but it doesn't. Right. It just buffs. It gives him a, a buff of four turns. I don't have anything to mark either. Not here, anyways. Um, <clears throat> but I could maybe do Grape Shot Blast 2. But still, that's low. Mm -hmm. But it does do two debuffs. Yeah, yeah. which is nice for everybody's. For everybody else. Mm -hmm. But I think I'm going to do Point Shot. No, point Blank Shot 3. Just because. Not Point Blank Shot. Pistol Shot? Oh, that's right. Yeah, pistol shot three. Sorry. You could put point blank on there. You haven't been pulled forward lately, though. But mm -mm. not point blank pistol one. Pistol shot but. three, and then point blank one. I could do. Mm-hmm. Unless you have something Which is else. Pretty it's... nasty. Yeah, point blank one's nice. You just have to be in the front position to use it. I'll do it. Same kind of idea. Okay. All right. You still got to pick a spot on the board. For the last day? No, we're still the second day. Oh, that's right. For the highwayman. For the highwayman. So if you don't have anything specific, I might buy her a positive quirk. I don't know if it'll help or not, but there's not a lot on the board that we need. How much does these cost? Eight. Oof. Yeah. It's nice, but they cost eight. Well, we're doing the long haul on this one, so I'll think mm -hmm. I'll send him over to uh, get two extra things for three. Okay. Alright, well, I think I'm going to take her here for three by a positive quirk. Maybe it'll be something that's... Jeez Louise. 
Oh my gosh. So when the light goes down, she heals with stress. When the light goes up, she heals health. <laughs> wow. She's a warrior of light mm. and a night owl at the same time. <laughs> Okay. okay, and then I have one more here, which is the grave robber. She doesn't have a spot. She's gonna go. She's gonna go here. Spend one and get rid of the rest of her stress. So we need nine nah, back. Uh -uh. What? Remember. Oh, I have to spend three to get rid of it. That's probably well. Good call. Good call. I just don't know what else to do. I guess I'll go here and draw an item. Draw a chest. Hope it's a bunch of money. It is not. It is not. It's another it's a dice. Re roll of a die. No, it's just add. It's just another dice. Randomly. Right. That's what I'm, that's what, yeah. That's what I meant. I'm okay. Sorry. All right. We're on last Set day. Wrong. Last day. I'm gonna roll for this knucklehead. No, oh, you can't go to the same face twice. Two. No, oh, he's gonna block us from buying any more goodies. Dang it. So. I'm going to take the Grave Robber here while you decide what to do. Mm -hmm. I'm going to spend six. Five of these and try to level up. And like you said. You're having my level three card. Yeah. Uh, grave Robber? Mm -hmm. There you go. Three dodge. Nineteen health. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna send the Crusader to the tavern. He's going to spend three to normally do six, but he only gets three, but that's all he has, so okay. Three that was my time. idea last time. You told me not to. Because I no, because gave a because. zealous speech in the town center mm. that healed everyone for five. But we don't want to do Where's that now. Lunch one? The highwayman, however, he is... He's going to go and heal three for one buck. At the sanitarium. So he just has. Have you got a one health? Never mind, I got it. I got a bunch of but this is my last one. I got lots of ones, I just don't have any fives. Okay. That's because I have them all. <laughs> this guy has some of them. Okay. That was pretty crazy. Okay, so everybody's gone here. We just got the Vestal left. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. No removals and negatives. No. I don't think I'm going to try to gain a virtue. I'm going to do that once. I really don't have much of a thing for her to do. <sighs> Hang out and look pretty. Well, not much for her to do. Maybe we're I'll... gonna we're gonna die. All right, then I'll buy another quirk. That costs three. Look at that. She got three positive quirks. When she bleeds, she takes one less bleed. But what happens if you get a negative quirk while they're in there? Then one of them goes away. Oh, they just get replaced. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, okay. How much is this? One of them. I need. It costs three. So seven. Bucks. Might as well if we're gonna die. We don't need money anymore. <laughs> Yeah. It is all or now nothing. Now you're starting it's, to understand it. It is him or us. So it's what it's what they said on Band of Brothers. See, you're worried mm -hmm, mm -hmm. because you think you're going to survive this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right. All right. So this gets flipped back over here now. Have these. Remember, our torch starts at four. Oh yeah. Hamlet. Hamlet goes away. We're back into the dungeon. That's not a bad 
start. Uh. <laughs> uh, why didn't you agree with me? Actually, that is... Oh, that's not a good start. <laughs> that's well, not I, a good start at I all. I didn't say it was good. I said it was not bad. So we have one room where the boss is. Face the threat. The threat has shown itself. Now it's time to strike. Find its lair and eradicate it. Set up this dungeon according to the boss quest rules. You can't return to the hamlet before you defeat the boss. That's right. And we are going to get three experience points for coming back home. But we do have a camp of 12. All right. One of our rooms there. We've got... We've got sorry. One, one. You stole it from me. Treasure. A little bit of everything. A couple of these. One of those. That's four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to take the boss one. And we're going to take one, two, three, four... So we're going to take three random ones of these. This is the boss. Mm -hmm. We're going to mix the boss with three of those. One of these is the boss. One of those is the boss? Uh-huh. Which one? Left, right, center. You win 25 cents if you get the right one. And if you don't, we're going to die miserably. Okay. There you go, the rest go in the middle. Mm -mm -mm. He's in one of those four outside spots. We're gonna die. Shh. Don't tell anybody yet. That's our mantra. We're gonna die. Well, if we're gonna die, we're gonna die after the Crusader. With <laughs> This is probably true. Alright, oh, well man. we got a lot of provisions. We do have a lot of provisions and we did buff up three of our kids. We get ten bucks for just coming in. That's right. Well, just throwing not. cash at us. All right. Look at that. Two torches. Maybe three. Can make that a third. Yeah. Um, or shovel. Look at this. Antidote Central. This was a DD, so. Yeah. We only have one shovel, two food. We better make that a shovel, even though our torch light's down. We might have to have some sparkle fingers save us again. <laughs> well, it, that's true. It would it would be that way. Okay. Not so bad. We got a lot going in. Hmm. Okay. We only have one room adjoining. So we gotta scout it out. Scout it out. Damn. Is this maybe a case where it would be better not to scout when we only have know. one room? I don't know. It's so hard to tell when you, you know, do you burn up double of those? Do you get some lucky curios? Yeah. Do you, okay, it's a curio room. Well, there's a chance it's not a battle. All right, we are exploring the hallway, the corridor. Darkness. Crusader. Oh, Curio. that's great. Highwaymen. And hungry. Food. Okay. So, curiosity and hunger. Yep. Well, I gotta use hunger, so we take that out. Okay. And that's that. Curios, what do we have to do? Well, we can burn a torch to not take the negative effects, or we can just... Take them as they lie. Run with it. Mm -hmm. And these are level three curios. No, the curios no, is just stay the just same. Curios. Yeah. yeah. Um. I'm gonna burn a torch for this one. I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna breathe it. I think so too. So I'll just draw a little curio. Strong box. Bleed for three turns. Bleed one for three turns. I am not resist. Uh, I am resistant to it, so it's only two turns. Are you resistant to it? Oh no, no. it was the Crusader. It was Crusader the Crusader. Had it. Never mind. Never mind. So yeah, just uh, one for three. Um, trinket. 
A long forgotten strong box sits on the cold stone floor. You praise your luck as you open it. This is serrated, serrated, serrated scalpel <laughs> slashes so at your right hand without losing your courage. You discover some coins and a valuable trinket. Mm -hmm. So five bucks. Mm, um, it's actually a pretty good one. Yeah, it's not bad. So five bucks and a level three. Yep. Ooh, for free. Exactly. Oh, but I get a positive quirk too. Yep, and a positive quirk. Ooh. It's not bad, not bad. I am balanced. So whenever I get pushed. You get pushed to less. No, you're immune I'm to I'm immune pushed. to push, but so that doesn't do me any good. You're really balanced. Oh my goodness. But I do have, this is awesome, a recovery charm. So I can heal myself for six damage. Just Six? by using it. No, nine. 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 Wow. And then to use it, I have to just take two, two stress. But then, it, oh, wow. So that's the interesting thing about curios, obviously. Because they it. can be, you know, that's where we get a lot of our trinkets from. I'll so Now, do you want him to keep it, though, yep. be in the tank, or do you want to give it to the grave robber? Healing himself for Nine. Yeah, but Isn't I mean... Isn't the tank the one that wants to heal all the... Takes all yeah, the damage? Sure, I guess. Yeah, you keep it. I just don't want to be selfish. Well, here goes the Vestal. I'm going to lose one of my three positive quirks. Here's my Curio. So you Increase. get plus one stress. I found a bookshelf. <laughs> found a negative quirk. Slow reflexes. So if I hit a trap, I get negative two dodge against the trap. Uh, what do I want to get rid of? When the light goes down, when I take a bleed, actually, I think when the light goes down. Yeah. That was not long lived. I get a bleed for three turns. Well, actually, I'm resistant and resistant, so I get one bleed for one turn. Oh, wow. And I get a trinket. Yeah. Here we go. The Fasting Seal. Plus five dodge, <gasps> or I can consume a food and get no effect to flip it back over. Yeah, that's so, pretty cool. It's five dodge. All right, so now we move forward. Yeah. All right, one to five. You roll it. One to five, no effect. One doesn't matter. It's half and a half. Is it's, it one to five or is it, it doesn't matter? the matter. It's half it's and half. 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 Okay, <laughs> we'll so say it. All I'm right. just saying right 50%. now, 1 to 5, 50%, no effect. All right, it's a battle. It's a battle. <laughs> no, we, no, I was wrong. Let's flip it over. It's 6 to 9. No, I'm just kidding. Six. <laughs> Doesn't work that way. All right, a healing fountain. Woohoo! Healing waters. Hero ending their turn here. Heal for 3. Um, I need to shuffle these, though, I think. I put those guys. I need to shuffle these. I might as well cut. <laughs> oh, no. Don't cut this time. He didn't see that. <laughs> uh. All right. Number three. We are in it to win it. That's five. Healing waters, heroes ending their turn heal here, here heal three. Yeah. So whenever we stop in here, this fountain heals us for three. <laughs> At the end of our turn. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice if it healed us for three for our <clears throat> All right, she's over there. And then no chests? No? Mm, nope. Okay, here we go. An adder. Level three adder. <laughs> I didn't cut. You told me not to. I didn't do a last minute cut anyways. So if you didn't like the rattler, you may not like his brother. <sighs> 55 damage. Hit points, I hope. Yes, 55 <laughs> hit points, 2 dodge, resistant to stun, immune to debuff, 
and movement. A brigand hunter. Do you have? Are you <laughs> top loading the no. top of the deck? No, I'm not. What are I'm you just, doing? I, I remember people saying that it looked a little too easy. <laughs> that we didn't hit Death's Door more than like three or four times last time. So. Oh my gosh! Oh look, we we entered the snake pit. No oh, dear. This is not going to end well. Come on, you said that last time, and we destroyed those dudes. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed well, them. Well, we know for sure that the Crusader at some point is going to hit Death's Door again. Even though he healed, he upgraded, got eight more health, mm -hmm. and healed himself. My goodness. And your point is? My, I have no point. <laughs> Not even on my lance. Next time you get the jester. All right, here we go. Oh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Stop shuffling cards. Hmm. All right, then. <laughs> See? Crusaders first. All right, Crusaders first. He's over here, and he's like, I'm out. <laughs> that is a big <laughs> snake. I think it has two heads. It does have two it heads. It does have two heads. One of them is molting. Uh -huh. Oh, dear me. You got some, like, giant smite or something. I, I have mm -hmm. smite mm -hmm. three, yes, but a lack of holy... They're, they're like, they were coming out of the woodwork. Oh, yeah, no, no unholy this time. I prepared for it this time, yes. and now they're not coming out. But... Um, this is a 11, um, but he can still only move one. So I can't do the holy, I can't do the smite. I can only oh. zealously accuse the guy of being an ugly snake. So we'll come up here, one. Or I use my speed stone. Yes. I use my speed stone and come up here with a movement of two. I'm gonna tap. He's got 55 health. He's got 55 health. Um, we are going to have plus two crit. I mean, uh, crit two. Uh, what is his? He, he is that. So we've got nine. Okay, I'm feeling good. You need a bleed for one. Nine. Like. Huh? Bleed. You got a bleed hidden right there. Oh, I do. So. This becomes five. Yep, yeah, so nine accuracy and three crit. Seven <laughs> crit. Seven crit. I like it. Got it. There it is. That's so that is crit. 19 damage. Heal one stress. Nice. That's 19 damage, ridiculous. baby. Woot! He's like, ouch. I just cut up. I just cut off that molting head. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna grow back. <laughs> two extra. Two, yeah, two, two more, more will grow back. All right. Um. So that's me. I moved, and then. Uh, cut. All right, on. Okay, Snake's turn. He wants to do a seven. He wants to do a number two. <laughs> sorry, every time you say that, I'm gonna <laughs> yeah, laugh about sorry. it. He wants to do his second attack, paralyzing quills. I didn't even know. What is this? Like a yeah. snake porcupine, porcupine snake? Against That's the closest, he unholy. wants to be one space away. So we need to move him. One space. Why don't we move him here? Yeah. Get him away from all these other guys up here. Sure. Okay. And he's going to attack the Crusader. Crit yep. chance of two. Accuracy of eight now. Ha-ha! <laughs> that. 
Get out of my face, you ah. dumb snake! Okay. Highwayman is next. Highwayman. Range three. Uh, we will go one, two, so that he can heal. Mm -hmm. And he will do pistol. pistol shot three. So we're using our new stuff. And we have crit one, two, three. Um, accuracy nine. Oh, man. Gosh. Oh. Horrible. And you heal up three. Horrible. All right. So Rattler goes next. He wants to do... A nine. Can you read which one that one is? It's number nine. one. Nine. So number one is the warning rattle. So it's where he buffs himself up. Doesn't do anything. He just stays right there. So he's up there going. Yeah, scared to move is what it is. That's right. You he just to... saw what I did to his <laughs> to his big cousin. Uh, you want to put two yeah, buff on so him. Two buff. A shield and a repost. Two buff. A shield. Still see. Okay. And for reference, the repost works on any attack. Yep. We looked it up. We looked it up. All right. He doesn't move at all, huh? No. Nope. He does not. Okay. Grave robber's Grave turn. Robber. Come on. He's gonna move on up. Come on, Cletus. And. Come on. He is not immune to. Blight, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and hit him with poison dart. Accuracy is 10, crit chance 4. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Did you make it? I hit. Accuracy is 10. Accuracy okay. is 12 minus 2. Got it. So it's just 3 damage. But you got a whole mess. I'll get it. I'll get it. One, two. Brother got a whole mess of this. Bam, bam, and bam. That's her turn. She heals up for three. Nice. All right. His turn. He wants to do his number Brigand one Hunter. attack. Brigand Hunter. I could not read. He wants to do blanket fire again yeah. against this room. He needs to be two spaces away. He can move two. And do it. And do it. Okay. Accuracy is 10. Unmodified crit chance, two. So, depending on. Actually, I think both of their. That's a nine. It's a nine. No, it misses. was laying flat right there. <laughs> All right, well, that's a miss. That's right, you dumb brigand. Okay, that leaves us with the Vestal. Vestal is going to... That dude is immune to stun again, or resistant to stun. My dazzling, my tickle fingers aren't working like they used to. <laughs> tickle fingers. <laughs> sparkle fingers. Sparkle fingers. What's wrong with you tickle fingers? You need to tickle, tickle the snakes. D scratch that. I'm editing that out. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Tickle fingers. That's what my son calls the Therizinosaurus with those big long claws. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Tickle fingers. All right. So health, we're okay. We don't need healing. We need to yeah, do we're some... we're good. We need to do some damage. Do some damage. I know that goes against her... Mm -hmm. You know, uh, hip, hip, Hippocratic Oath. <laughs> but uh, All right, so first thing she's going to do is judgment. Judge that snake. Yeah. She's going to judge him. Accuracy is eight. Crit chance. Did she have a buff of three? What did I do with my buff of three? I don't know. She I'll should have it. had one. I'll get it. I don't know how I did with it. I just need two of them. So. Okay. Huh. Yeah. Anyways, accuracy... Eight, crit chance three. Well, that's a hit. Just for five damage. On the... On snake. the snake? Snake? A big one? Yep. 
What's he called? An adder. Yeah. And then that heals her for three as well. He's walking around with an abacus. And then she's going to do dazzling light on him. She doesn't really want to do dazzling light on him. Yeah, she's going to do dazzling light on him. Accuracy eight, crit chance three. He's resistant to stun though. I know. Okay. I missed anyways. All right. So that sucked. That's that. That's it. Round two. Round two. Fight. Here we go. We got that little clock out there that plays a Christmas song. Nice. On the hour. Every hour. Yeah. That's what you're hearing right now. Crusader! Nothing wrong with Christmas. No, there's nothing wrong with Christmas. I of get, course there isn't. I get good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> For myself. <laughs> um, yeah, hopefully my wife doesn't watch this. All right, let's see here. What do we... So he's at 27 out of 55. Yeah. He does have the ability to heal himself. He does? Yeah. Oh, with that molting. He can molt and heal. Oh. He... Actually, he won't molt while he's in the front of the... So as long as we leave him out front, he will not molt. Huh. As long as he's in aggressive stance. Yeah. Yeah. So. Got it. So he has to be back on... Defensive. He has to be back here. Or in defense. Yeah. <clears throat> or in defense? Yep. No. Defensive or ranged. Oh, gotcha, you gotcha. Yeah, 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 you're right, you're right, you're right. I got you, I got you. Yep. Okay. Um, well, uh, since we don't have to worry about him healing then, um, and you've already got that blight, I'm going to focus on the Brigand Hunter mm -hmm. and uh, use some of that Smite 3 magic on him. Nice. So... Uh, or, I could do, is he resistant to anything? He's not resistant to stun, but it's accuracy 10 versus accuracy 11. I could do a stunning blow on him mm -hmm. and give him two two turns of, uh, uh, stun him twice. Um, I could do that. Makes him worthless for the next two rounds. I'm going to do that. So, I got crit 2, accuracy 7. That's the only down thing. Let's see. Got him. Got him. All right, so that's five damage. Wow. Five damage on him two and two uh, stuns. And did you take a bleed? It's like you want me to die. <laughs> no. I know. We're just staying true to what's going on. That's all good. All right. Um, that was one. I think you thump him upside the head. Oh, that's right. That was. Not even I'm done. so used to walking around walking and only doing around. one thing. One swing so, at a time. So uh, that was a that was a stunning blow. So now I'm gonna spite. Should get extra critical while they stunt. So um, I wish. <laughs> so it's crit one, two, three, accuracy eleven, modified eight. Yep. That's definitely crit. I mean, cop. <laughs> Was a nine or a one? That one is a two. crit. There you go. That's that a is crit. a crit. So that's nineteen more damage. He is toast. Nope, that's the end of him. Wow. Okay. Well done. Oh, here's the. That was we'll, cool. That felt good. We'll take it. But now the. Snakey's turn. The adder. The adder's turn. He wants to do a paralyzing quills again. Two, yeah. Against the closest, which would be the crusader. Yep. Crit chance two, accuracy eight. Wow. Out two misses of here. in a row. I endured that second, that horrible patch. Of rolling dice to do better now. I'm not going to overstate it because I don't want to jinx it. Okay. Rattler's turn. Okay, let's see what he's doing. He's now in range, so... He's all the same. He wants to do a... What did he roll? Three. Three. He wants so to two. do a snake bite. Snake bite. That's the closest, which would be Crusader. He moves three to get there. If he needs a range of one. Yep. 
That's it. So crit chance two, accuracy eight. <sighs> you almost did it again. I did. Almost. All right. So that's five damage and two bleed for three turns. Five damage. And You're two not... bleed for three turns? Yep. Ouch. I mean, ouch. That other guy did 11 to you the first time he ever laid eyes on you. Yeah, you should be happy. It's right that now. bleed, man. Okay. It's that bleed, bro. Okay, so the rest is just us. They've both gone. So, Highwayman is next. Alright, Highwayman. He is going to um uh, let's go ahead and do uh, is he resistant yeah he's he's immune to deep to debuff okay. Um, I think we'll stay with pistol shot three. He has one, two, three crits. He should have taken that four damage. Three crits and accuracy 11, so accuracy nine. So he should have taken four damage from that blight. Okay. Accuracy nine, crit three. Nice. Point, I'll take, uh, pistol I'll shot take one three. Of those. That is fifteen damage. One, two, three. He's at forty-six, man. Wow. Okay. Fifteen. So yeah. That's only your first attack. I know. Again. Forty-six. Black soul. 46, so I just need to do uh, 46, 9. And 6 more damage. Yeah, 6 more damage. So, can't do that though. Because I can't use Pistol Shot 3 again. But I could use Grape Shot Blast and use my Damage Stone for yeah. 3. I'll do that. So, uh, Grape Shot Blast. That's going to be accuracy six. Ac oh, accuracy six, crit two. Miss. Mm, we're not. Yep. Okay. Grave robber's turn. She is. What do we say? We need six. Yeah. So she'll just go straight for dagger throw. Accuracy will be nine. Crit chance four. Okay, so that's a hit for seven damage. Actually, a hit for ten damage. Ten damage? Yeah, because he's blighted, she gets an extra three. Oh, and that puts him at 46, 56. He's out. Oh, he's done? 10, 20, 30, 40. Yes, that's it. Dan, dan, dan! Get that ugly snake out of here. Okay. So okay. now, first one. We got the rattler left. For a second one, of course she doesn't have that kind of range. Well, she'll just walk over one. Actually, she'll go here, just to keep us spread out. And I don't want to block this. Oh no, the three people can go there. I'll go there, why not? Okay. <laughs> turn. Don't do that. Right. All right. So for her, she's just going to walk slow like Gordon normal. And uh, she's going to use her new toxic toxin trickery <laughs> on you. So she's going to give herself a buff of two. Mm -hmm. You're going to take this. Um, don't take that. Take that one. Will you give her a buff of two, please? And give the Crusader a buff of two. And then she cures all blight and bleed on the crusader. And on herself. So she doesn't have any, but 
He just cured that. Sweet. That's your turn. Keep reading them books. <laughs> Keep reading them books, huh? Yeah. All right. Find out all that trickery. One, two, three, four. Not so bad. Not as bad as the bone captain ever was. Mm mm. Mm mm. But we did get a lot of crits on that we on that stupid a lot thing. Of good stuff. So, yep. All right. Well, he gets to go first of all things. He still gets a buff of one. So that's crit plus one. He's now in the front. Doesn't matter. He still gets to choose. He wants to do a seven. Uh, so he's going to do one. a warning rattle. Oh, jeez. He's going to do a warning rattle. Buff himself for two. Shield and repost for one turn. Well, that's going to kind of hurt. He's got 22 health. Everything we do to him, we take half. Until he uses... Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Ouch. So the repost goes on there, too. Yep. So now we just go down the line since he went first, huh? Yep. Owie. <clears throat> we take half? Mm, we take half. Snakes should be unholy, I'm just saying. <laughs> um, did he stick an action? No? No. I'll wait. I'm right behind you. I can heal you. Yeah, I'll wait. I'll you could even heal yourself and zealously accuse if you wanted to. I think I will do that. Um, well, you that seems burn, a waste, burn that though. up, right? Yeah, well, you still get it on waste. the zealous accuse. You get on the crit on your heal too. Yeah. All right, so I got. And he's not stressed whatsoever. Buff so. two, so that's one, two, um, three, three, four, five for my heal. Uh, so five crit chance. Got it. Nice. So that's heal five. So I'll get rid of that and just take this. And then zealously accuse. I have crit three, accuracy ten, accuracy eight. So eight crit three. <laughs> we gonna take that? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna take that? Alright. So that's eleven for the adder. Okay. And six it. for you. Ouch. Half round it up. There you go. Okay. That's it. Highwayman. Highwayman. Jeez. Um. One, two. And then a pistol shot. Crit, one, two, three, accuracy, nine. That's just a hit, regular hit. So that's nine damage on him. Mm -hmm. And so five on me. I got this. Okay, five on me. Yep. All right, well, he's at 20. All right, highly, or grave robber. You want to toy with him a little bit? Well, I mean, he still has a chance of getting a, a hit on us for even if he does five damage to somebody and puts some bleed on. He's yeah. I just don't want to hit him with anything heavy. So really, what I he only needs two. Mm -hmm. Although my accuracy sucks on some of these. Oh, that's okay. I can poison dart him. He's. Resistant to the blight, but I only do three damage if I don't crit. So, crit chance three, no, crit chance four, accuracy mm. ten. Yep. Got him. Okay, three damage to him, he's, he's out, dead. she takes two. That's pretty nasty. He didn't yeah. buff himself before. Yeah, that is pretty bad. There's a repost in the card deck. Okay. That, that was, was a K. 
Mercurio. Yeah. So we need to decide who gets the Curio. Yes. Um. Whether or not we're using the torch. I think. I saved the torch. Yes. Grave robber can take the Curio. I'm good with that. Okay. Grave robber. Stack Found of a books. stack of books. So you get plus one stress, a negative quirk. Man. So you're a stress eater. Great. I'm a stress faster and a stress eater. You yeah. get buff for two turns. Okay. And you get a trinket. Wow. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. You have the Book of Sanity, which gives, if you use it, it's minus four. Mm -hmm. And then, and then to six use it, to... you suffer six damage to be right. able to... Now we're playing Cthulhu Death May Die. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. <laughs> okay. I All like right. it. Book of Sanity. <clears throat> so now we're going to scout again. For sure. <clears throat> scout, and that reveals this guy and this guy. Oh, that's not good. Um, I say we definitely come this way. And what if he's there? It's a long backtrack. <clears throat> yeah, I agree. But we can reveal two of the out outer ones over here. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. We'll take the chance. It's yeah, I'm okay with that. Okay. Crusader. Go. And I oh, shovels. Oh. Look at that! Four shovels. And we only got one. Remember, level three dungeon. Oof. So. That's what? The damage on these is three and three. Three health, three sanity. Three and three. The on what? The damage on these. These things? Mm-hmm. The, the pile of bones? The, yep. And the damage on this is two and three, depending on if you get a or six. A nine, depending on if you get a crit. For the traps? Mm-hmm. All right, well, um, I will take... Although we can dodge the traps. One, two, three. We can dodge the traps how? Well, with our dodge skill, it goes against the traps. Oh, yeah, so. yeah, yeah, gotcha. Um, Only a 50% chance Can we take us. a combination of, or does it have to be all one or no, all No, this is three and three. Three oh, it's that, three, three damage. Three both. Three both. Oh, oh my. <clears throat> three both. I've got 12 damage here, so i got 20 left. She's okay taking three and three. Um. Okay, well the Crusader's not going to let you show them up, so we'll take three and three as well. Okay. With this. And these two traps? Two shovels? Yeah. I think so. Okay. I wish I could reroll all those friggin' antidotes. Oh, uh, really? Alright, so now we are here in the darkness. We're here in the darkness. We either gotta burn a torch or lose a light. Oh, lose a light? Sure. So that takes that out. No, it does not. Every time oh, we go through that room, yeah, it does the same. Yeah, it's not like that other one that yeah, we no, actually could you, light them up. That'd be nice. But. So now we gotta move so, again. Yep, yeah, we got a scout. Scout? Uh, no, we're not scouting yet. We gotta yeah, move here. No, we're scouting. Really? Yeah. Either that, or we use two black dice to go from there to there. Two encounter dice each. Okay. It's a long hallway, is what it's called. So it doubles it up for us. All right. So. I might need some of this. And now we roll. Mm hmm. Now we roll. Oh, there it is. Jeez Louise. Alright, well, this is a food. Stressful darkness, two stress. Okay. That's and it. These three and three. Man, 
I would propose that I use two of these to lower my stress a little bit. Yes, do that. Let's try to maintain a little bit. But three and three otherwise. Got it. Okay, that so was brutal. We're here. And we're scouting. And we scout again. God, uh, we really need to Golly, hope George. and pray. Come on, get it. Nope. We don't want to go there. Come on. Nope. You said nope. <laughs> and that. And a fight. Well, we can't go back this way without taking another darkness. So we're going to have to go that way. We can't. If we backtrack, and we got to do it. All or none. Yes? Louise. Crusader. Trap. Highwayman. Trap. Ooh. I think my luck Trap is wrong. Naptis. All right. Well, stressful darkness. We lose a torch. She goes insane. Yeah. Curio, I'm going to take it while you're deciding how to die to your traps. Yeah, really. She's going to take one stress, a negative quirk, which is going to kick out another positive quirk. Now if she takes a blight, she takes another one for three turns. Honestly, I'm going to get rid of this one because I never use it. Oh. And I get a bleed for three turns, but for her it's only one turn. And I get a new disease. <laughs> Papa needs a new disease. <laughs> Why did you climb in the suit of his armor exactly, Vestal? <laughs> you got nothing better to do than get bulimic. If I eat a food, I gotta eat another food and take a stress. Alright, here we go. Okay. So what are what are the what are the stats on these now? Um, accuracy what? Accuracy eight. So it's accuracy two. six for the Crusader, crit chance two. Oh, six damage. Ouch. Six damage. So that's going to be 21. <laughs> and accuracy five. Five. That's six damage? Yep. Yeah. Alright, so I'll take this. Add six to it to make it to no, your eight or fourteen. And you have a ten. Yep. You don't need the extra ten. But yeah, I don't. thought you might want it. Nope. I do not. <laughs> Alright. I do not. That puts us there. Man, if we skipped it here. I know. <laughs> this could be our undoing. It probably will be. The ritual chamber. Oh, no. Dust. Heroes ending their turns in the orange suffer one extra stress. That's definitely what we don't need. And number one. I think all of us are going to go crazy. Nuts. This battle. Man, oh man. Yeah. We were doing so good. We were. Okay. It's past tips, though. This is how the cookie crumbles. Alright. Dear, oh dear. We got a couple chests. Hopefully, we can get some gear out of those. Got one here. And one here. But we don't want to stay there, we though. We do not want to stay there. No matter what, we do not want to stay there. All right, look, a maggot. Okay, level one, we got you. <laughs> we 
got you in the bag. <laughs> Let's one. pull some more level ones out of there. All right, level one Pliskin. Been a while since we've okay. seen one of those guys. All right, okay. We can we can still handle you guys. Man, Where's that little Pliskin at there, Jim. He's not that little. No, he's he not. He looks pretty nasty. Oh, you see, uh... look at that. A level one cutthroat. <laughs> So we got a beast, a beast, and a human. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Here's your cutthroat. And a level 19 cultist acolyte. Level 1. <laughs> cultist acolyte. Uh -huh. Sorry. Oh, man. Still, we got four people to deal with. But the amount of damage that we have to deal is drastically less. I mean, drastically. It doesn't less. say each of them get 25 extra hit No, it doesn't. <laughs> so let's not read into it, all right? All right. There we go. Oh, Who's man. We had to do 100 blast. damage to that in that other room. Mm -hmm. Now we're like, like 40. There you go. So we're good. Okay. All right. Watch, well, we're gonna get ripped to shreds. We're gonna no, we're miss. gonna be fine here. They're gonna it's be just critting. The, the boss is gonna be back here. Ah, we'll get to it. We'll just mm -hmm. break through the wall right here. <laughs> we only have to take one, two, three. I've been three. using my compass. I know that this room is. Oh there. yeah. Yeah. Objects in the mirror are different than oh. they appear. Yeah, maybe so. All right, do it. Uh, right. Are any of those things unholy? I don't think so. Maybe the no. cultist is? No. They're no. human. Okay. Wow. All right. Maggot goes first. He wants to do a grave nibble <laughs> against the closest. Oh, the grave nibble. So he'll move one, range mm -hmm. one. So crit chance three, accuracy five against the crusader. He misses. And there it is. No nibbling on the armor today. All right, number two. Pliskin. Uh, Pliskin wants to he do wants number to do, two. Uh, That's he the, does. He wants to infuse. infuse. That's right. He's the uh, barista <laughs> of yeah, the group. Against the closest. Um, that would be him. Yep. He needs to be in the same space. He can't move in. It's full. So he, he doesn't it. do it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Next up, it's Crusader. All right. So the Crusader is going to <laughs> we're going to zealously accuse <laughs> the, the maggot. maggot. Yes. Oh come on. No. Definitely. Poor maggot. Um, we're gonna heal first though, um, and I have a crit chance. If you heal, you're gonna stay there and take a stress. I'll heal later. Well, accuse him first. Move last. Oh, it doesn't matter, I guess. Did you wanna? Yeah, whatever you wanna do. This is gonna put you farther away hitting. from everybody. Just put. Yeah. yeah. But it puts a. It's it's a it's a. Um, better chance of hitting too, though. So accuracy. 11, so yep. it's gonna hit. Crit chance 2, or did you just get rid of a crit thing? Doesn't matter, that's a crit. So I get to heal stress, and then and he's, dead. he's dead. Puddle of goo. <laughs> Squish the maggot into a puddle of goo. Alright. Okay. So next up is the highwayman. Again, this is a dark room. Mm hmm. Acolyte hasn't gone yet. Right. We'll do a wicked slice on the acolyte. Nice. So wicked slice on the acolyte is going to be accuracy ten. Uh, 
nine uh, crit chance of two. So that's a hit, nine damage, it's dead. Nine damage no matter what. Yep. Okay, well. That would be the brigand's turn. Yep. All right. He wants to do, oh no, he doesn't even need to roll. He wants to do, oh he did need to roll, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A what uppercut it? slice against the closest, zero range. And he only has movement of one, so he just moves one. Oh, all right. Okay, so that means Grave Robber's turn. Grave Robber is... This, this gives a really good show of how much more difficult oh, level yeah. three people three are. Up. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, because this is like, uh, you know, God mode and Rise of the Triad back in the day. Sure. Yeah. I think I'm going to uh, I'm going to pick up this chest. <laughs> you didn't even ask. You just did it. Mm. Added food. Wasn't the greatest chest ever. <laughs> and then I'm going to move to there. And the Vestal's turn. She's not going to pick up the chest. Why not? Because she needs to heal the blockhead. Oh, she can. She's she got to move. Not, yeah, she to make her yeah, go she's crazy. She's got to move. Okay, so she's going to heal the blockhead. Oh, she's going to take one bleed. Blockhead will be very appreciative. And crit chance. One, two, three, four, five. Crit chance six. Oh, boy. Okay, so that's a crit. She heals a stress. That makes her tempted to pick up a chest. <laughs> and he gets nine health. I will trade in a ten for a one any day. And then she is going to... You know, I think she's just going to step right there. And hope that her team saves her. Yes. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Round two. Round two. This is quite the thing. Quite the thing? Indeed. Yep. I just looked at both of the cameras because I had the fleeting thought in my head. That they weren't working? Did I start recording? <laughs> I was wondering <laughs> if the sound was on. but No, the sound's always on oh. if the camera's on. All right, here we go. Paladin first. Paladin. Oh, Crusader, right. sorry. Crusader. Oh. Slow Sader is what we call him usually. Uh, wow. He is... Yeah, he's kind of away from nowhere. That's what I said about walking that way. Yeah. When you don't have your speed deal. I don't. Well, technically I could use it now. You could use it now and just heal yourself. Yes. So we'll do that. And we have crit three. So it's not a crit three, but it's a regular three. So. What are you healing? Three? Yeah, nine. And that's all I can do. Okay, Highwayman is up. A highwayman will slice and dice yeah we're gonna we're gonna open we're gonna do wicked slice on the pliskin okay wicked slice on the pliskin accuracy nine mm -hmm. crit two. two that's caught Ooh, right on yep so that's nine damage. Yep, that's all he's got. Dead. 
Out bonk, an easy bonk, row, bonk, for good bonk, sake. Bonk. Sometimes the luck helps. Alright, I'd like to do a, turn. a little bit more healing before we get out of here, but... Yeah? Because the Highwayman is... He's at 14, so... He's got a whopping 8 health left. Okay, well the Grave Dauber is going to use her Book of Sanity. One, two, three, four. Cool. And then she is going to... wonder why she doesn't have her other skill there. What did I do with that skill? I had a skill there. I swear Man. I did. Huh. I flicked it under a border sign. I'll find it. Yeah. Alright, anyways, she's going to then... Wait. If she swings, she'll kill him probably. Actually, that is not true. He has eight. She's going to go ahead and do a poison dart at him. Crit chance, four. Accuracy, ten. Okay. He's already went, right? Uh, no. Not this room. No, oh, then I don't want to do that. I need him to live. I was thinking at the, you know, next round when he came up that he would die. <laughs> We're like a cat playing with a mouse. Yeah, no, I don't want him to. <laughs> no, I, I'll just take my turn then. I was thinking he'd already went, so. Okay, so that's her turn. Vestal gets to go next, so. Alright, so Vestal will heal. Stop doing that. Crit chance five for this guy. Seven health, heal, no crit, obviously. And then. So. Which one of them's down the worst? Oh, well, he's I mean, two spaces away. So I can't do that. So, he'll, she'll heal him again. With Divine Comfort. Crit chance 5 again. So that's a crit. He gets 4 health. And she gets 3. That's really better. That's for, like, she does a whole room full of people, but... Yeah. Alright. Kush your deals. Oh, so he goes so he, next. He didn't go? Yeah, he's or next. he goes now? Yeah, he goes now. Yeah, okay. So, all right, so he goes now. He's in the front. He's looking around going, Mama, <laughs> Mama. He wants to do a uppercut slice against the closest. He's going to do that against the Vestal. Crit chance, two. Accuracy, seven. It's the first time she's been attacked today. And that's, that's a, a crit. crit. Dang. For nine damage? Ooh. Okay then. Ow. We played with that mouse for too long. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Man, whose idea was playing with that? Alright. Let's not do that again. Nope. Okay. There we go. Crusaders first. And he's still too far away. He is. He's still too far away, but here's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to go back one for my first attack. Okay. I mean, for my first action. Just one? Yeah. You can go anywhere you want in there. Um, oh, then you can get lunch. No, the Holy Lance it oh, has to be as a range of one, so I wouldn't be able to do that. Um, so, yeah, just put me back one. I don't, I don't want to do anything. I just want to get out of the uh, aggressive stance so I can okay. write my warrior's ring. You want to heal? Um, yes, I'm going to heal, but I'm going to use this. Oh, gotcha. And it's accuracy minus two, mm -hmm. so it's uh, accuracy 14, uh, 12 instead of 14. Nice. So I'm still going to get it, but, um... 
crit, and it's a crit, so that's good. So I get to heal a stress, and I heal five. Right on. That's nice. So that worked out. Okay. Highwayman's next. Highwayman, are we? Are we? Are we? Yeah, we got finish We good? Yeah. Yeah, we're good. All right. So let's go ahead and do that. Now watch. I'm gonna miss. Um, pistol shot. Accuracy eleven. Nine. Uh, crit two. That's a crit. crit. So he gets to heal dead. one. You get to heal one. And he's dead. Right on. Okay. Get that card back. Now this go. This room goes away because that it's room. The combat yes, room. goes away. Yep, now it's just an empty space. Now, we want to use our, uh, my brain's not working, our camp. Camp? Yeah, I think we should. Just, uh, well, should we scout first? Sure, no harm in that. Let's scout first to see if that's where we need to go. It is? It is, okay. Whew. I was not looking forward to traipsing back through <laughs> no, the dungeon. No, me neither. <laughs> me uh -huh. neither. All right, so now we'll take our tw our camp of 12. <clears throat> so let's get your people uh, maybe three and three. Use this for stress. Yeah. I'd rather, I might want to take some of yeah. that off. Uh, um, that's I'm going to do three and one. At least take off two of this. So that's six spent anyways. There's six left. And then... Got four damage, so that's 28 damage I can take. And 19 damage I can take up here. Yeah, Vestal's the weakest, that goes. So... One, two... Three... Four, maybe let the Vestal take another couple hits, two, two, two more damage off. Okay. Yeah, I think that's good. That's all 12. Okay. So we know where we're going, we just gotta roll these now. Yeah, one last time. Crusade. <gasps> I saw it. Hi, women. Crap. There's food, though, so I'm good. Okay. So, Crusade or nothing, you got one food. Yes. I do not have this, so the accuracy is five. Good chance, two. Yeah. That's a miss. And a stressful darkness. I guess that's too stress. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we're going in right there. Yeah. It's time. It's time. <laughs>with that last room and just having a bunch of uh, uh, level one pip squeaks in it. Uh, so that must have been the riffraff because behind it was this dude, the prophet, and he's a nasty old man because he's got eyeballs in his hands and they're still dripping with blood and that's disgusting. But uh, let's see here. He has... 151 health. He's got a dodge of three, for crying out loud. And he's got Eye on You, which does not much damage. Not much damage. But if he does a Rubble of Ruin attack on us... So, so he has uh, two turns of stun. 
possible, so that's not good. Oh man, and yeah, a, I didn't even look at and that. A possible three blight for three. Oh and a snap! So room. it's low damage, but the effects. So the way he works is he has his own special room. Yeah, I know that. Uh huh. All these little spots are pew spots. Yep. On his turn, he's gonna place these pews out. He gets three attacks per round. And his third attack is going to be attacking every space with a pew for 16 or 24 damage. Oh. All of them. And I guess he rolls, he rolls to see where he places them? Yep, he rolls to place them at the beginning. Whoa. So we In know where they're going to be if that, if that happens. Yeah, well his first deal in the round is going to be to roll and place them. His second will be to do one of these things and his third will be to attack all those spaces. So if you're standing there, that's either 24 or 16 damage. Accuracy at 10, he can miss. But he rolls each space, one at a time. My he's goodness. The, he's the only enemy here. So these guys come off for now. Those guys come off for now. Okay, so that's pretty much what uh, the Prophet, uh, that's what it says here. He gets three actions per round. Uh, his special ability is called Calamitous Prognostication. At his first turn, he rolls... First turn of each round, he rolls four ten-sided dice, places the four wooden pews in the corresponding areas on the board. What if he rolls the same number on two of them? Then, uh, then there's multiple pews in one spot, and he'll attack that spot multiple times. Oh! So you're stuck there. So he is a jerk. Jerk. At his third turn each round, the Prophet uses his Rubble of Ruin skill, tar targeting all areas with wooden pews, roll and attack for each area separately. Yeah. Wow. Okay. This just got interesting. I'm just kidding. Well, it's some, been interesting for quite going some to time. Death's door. Not like we haven't been there before. Wow. You're just going to throw the Crusader under the bus like that, huh? With his little eyes there. And we have got 32 bucks waiting on us. <laughs> if 32. Is <laughs> there something that says we get 100 bucks if we beat him or something? No. Oh my goodness. So this guy comes up here. <clears throat> and this guy will go down here. Alright. We're about to light this dude up. We are about to light this dude up. 151 health. 3 dodge. Can't stun him. Can't push him. But we can make him bleed and blight. There we go. He is first. Oh, no. So to start it off, he's going to roll four. four of those. All right, here we go. All right, so two and ten, a two and a five. Ten twice? Yep. Okay, so ten twice. That's He <clears throat> planned that one possibly. A two and a five. Alright. So he just cordoned off one side. So that's his turn. Second turn is the highwayman. Oh, he's still behind the crusader. Ooh. Did we yeah. move? We had the opportunity to Red. resort that. Good thing that we have some things we can do. Okay. And um because we might as well go ahead and try to we're gonna move here for one. Mm -hmm. um, and then we will open the vein. I'll give you your dice pack. So uh, he has an accuracy of 11, 8, crit chance of 1. Alright, get him. That's a 4, so that's 7 damage, but he does take 2 bleed for 3 turns. Okay, you get the 7, I got the 2 bleed. Yep, yep. Your prophetic days are over, sir. Okay. We're halfway there. <laughs> Lemon <laughs> and a pear. <laughs> yeah. Crusader's up. Crusader. Um. Crusader. Okay, we're gonna. Is this guy unholy? He is unholy. He is unholy. Good. It's one stress each. <laughs> Jerk. <laughs> Thanks. 
I was talking about him. He's oh, a jerk. Got it. Not you. Um, all right. We're going to move one. And then we're going to do... Oh, I can't because I'm in defensive mode. I can't do Holy Lance. Crap. Um, we're just going to... Why fix it <laughs> if it's not broken? All right. That's what I'm talking about. We're just going to zealously accuse this fool of walking around with this stupid wood thing on his neck. Throw the Necromancer's scroll at him. That's right. Be cool if you could have So, that. accuracy of seven, crit chance one. Seven. Got it. Seven, so that's six more damage. Okay. Oh. Thirteen. His turn next. He is going to. He is going to do a. What does that say? A punishment? Uh, no. Fulminate. <laughs> He's going to fulminate the most crowded room. We're it's testing started. your vocabulary on this round too. What does fulminate mean? And read upside down. <laughs> it probably says something completely different than that, but that's close <laughs> enough. All right, so he's going to attack the crusader. Crit chance two, accuracy eight, sir. Okay, that's a six. He's gonna do three damage and three blight for three turns. So three damage and three blight for three turns. Yep. Antidotes take care of that though, right? Yep. Okay. All right. Now it's his second action. The grave robber gets to go <laughs> next. And she does not want to be where she's at. Right? He is not immune to blight, though. So she's going to move. Where's the one spot? I just had a thought. What? When he doesn't go first. I know. That sucks. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Yeah, when he doesn't go first, besides the fact that he could go before the Vestal at any time. Right. So, when you're, you're right. When he doesn't go first, more and more people are going to be. All right, so she's going to move here, and she's going to do a poison dart. Accuracy, that's... No, that's gone already. I'm pretty sure. Accuracy, 12. Accuracy, 9. Crit chance, 3. Mm. Okay. So that's three damage and four blight for three turns. Start stacking on the damage. You want to get the three damage for him? I just lost a counter. Down the crack. <laughs> that's table. okay. No worries. Okay. Three damage. Oh, what? Three damage? It's going to be two. five. Yeah. Okay. All right. Sixteen. That's not going up as fast as I would like it to. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, we're going to spend half of our turn moving. Well, wait a minute. To get away from I got a stuff. question. Yeah. He's activating three turns around, so these, like every round, these are going to go, and he's going to take twelve and six, so he's going to take eighteen damage mm -hmm. every, every three. Every turn. Every three activations, turn, right? Take it, yeah. Yeah. So that's not bad. We just got to keep loading them up. Yeah. Otherwise, they would stack and the go up. longer time, right? All right, Vestal gets to go next. Get out of Dodge. She doesn't want to be in Dodge. She is going to, well, before she moves out of Dodge. Um, who needs heals? Mm. Seven, five, six. We all kind of do. <laughs> yeah, um, cool. But, I mean, you're, you're over there by the Grave Robber right now, mm. so... I would go with healing, healing who you can, when you can. She's going to, actually I'm going to do a judgment against him. Accuracy, oh, seven, crit chance, two. Three. Oh. Okay, so she's going to heal for three. Ah. And she's going to do... Oh, you, you're, you're healing. I mean, well, judgment, what is the crit on judgment? That's just an accuracy bonus. So I hit. Oh, it's not a crit sorry. Bonus. Yeah, yeah, no so that's mind. five more damage to her. And she's going to move out of dodge. 
And then he's gonna attack all the pyre spaces. But he did get the last one. Pew spaces, not pyres. Pew. Pyre was the last dude. So none of those have to be four, five, six, seven. So none of those happen. So he just stays right there in the middle? Well, unless he wants to move. I mean he will move he his will second move some one. of this stuff. Okay. Yeah, depending on how close and far but we are. He should have taken six more damage. Yes. On that last turn? Yep. No, we don't need that yet. Crusade or Highwaymen's first. Mm. Highwaymen. We'll do a. Um... Oh man, <clears throat> I'm gonna stay there because at least it's a a single number and not a double or here mm -hmm. or a double or here. Um. But the likelihood of a 10 being rolled, I wonder. Well, let's just see first. Um, we're going to go with uh, Open Vein again. So, accuracy 8, crit chance 1. Okay. It's a hit. That's another 7 damage and 2 bleed Jeez, for 3 turns. 7 damage. <clears throat> I guess that's a good way to say it because it's damage per turns, not damage per rounds. What do you mean? Yeah, well, yeah, he's yeah. counting down. Yeah, it's per turn, right? Per not, turn. not not yep. per round. Um, right. So that was his one attack. Should I move to ten, or should I just stay here? Same, it's same kind of the same, same and the same, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm just going to stay here and. Um, Zero to one, point blank shot. That makes me move one though. Ooh, I might want to do that because back. of the Crusader. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Point blank shot, we'll take it. Um, so accuracy seven, crit two. Miss. That's a miss, but it still pushes you. Pushes away. me one away and I choose where I go? Yep. All right, Crusaders next. So he's gonna take three blight. Oh, yeah, three blight. So this turns into a ten. You have a ten. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna drink one of these antidotes to get that off. Then we'll move one into the six area and do a smite three. It's like Russian roulette. It is. <laughs> it's absolutely that. <laughs> but I mean, you 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 almost have to to land on these single spaces yeah. Yeah. because there's less of a chance than these these two spaces. Mm -hmm. So. All right, so uh, accuracy 11, so accuracy 8, crit uh, 2. Oh. It was a 1! That was a 1! Oh. Uh. All right. Um, yeah. Okay, roll the four dice. Oh, dear. Here it goes. That is 8 points of damage. 8 more? All right, so just put a yeah. 10 on there. Oh, that's cool. That's all right. I'll take one for the team. His turn. But that was his turn, right? Oh, no, you did the damage. I Never did mind. that last one. Now I'm going to yeah. do it again. He wants to do a three. He gets eight more damage. 
All right, so just take the two off, put a ten on. He's one third. He's one third. And he wants to do a eye on you to the most crowded space, <laughs> which is these two. Gusting. This could be really bad. I'm gonna move in there. Accuracy, crit chance two, accuracy 11, depending on the modified. I'm not rolling it. Against my two characters. That's a six, that's that a hit. hit. That hits both. So, I'll get that's three. three damage each. Oh no. Yep. They're both stunned for two turns. Um, we didn't push this. We're in round two. It doesn't matter. Rounds oh, don't. that's right, that's right. Rounds yeah, don't matter duh, with duh. the bosses. Duh, duh, duh. Three damage each. Two stun each. So two stun for the grave robber. And they all, then they both get plus one, one plus stun one, uh, here. Stress. Plus one stress. Oh, that's going to put the vessel over the top. She gets to roll her test. Ooh. And she gets a virtue. Virtue. That's right. It's she a ray of shining virtuous. light. She is stalwart. And she can lose stress, even though she can't lose it past there. So, mm -hmm. okay. That's his turn. Number Grave Robber's next, so she has one action, Yeah. <clears throat> which means she needs to stay there, and she needs to, he doesn't have Blight on him anymore, so that's, I guess she'll Blight him again or try. Yeah. So, <clears throat> crit chance three, accuracy nine. Crit. Yes. One there. It's five damage. Got it. Okay. And the blight is back on. <laughs> okay. That's her turn. Ooh, Vestal's up. She has one action. And she is going to... I don't think she can do that one in... Nope, she can't heal herself in this... I mean, she can heal... Um... She can't heal her at that distance. So the problem is, is every middle one, there's a 50% chance that he's going to attack the most crowded room. Oh, he's always going to attack the most crowded room, which makes the one spot where there's no pyre or mo no the pew, one you want to stay away from. The one you want to stay away from because it's the most because it's dangerous to just stand there and take a beating and blight mm -hmm, and everything else. Mm -hmm. So, but she's not fast enough to do anything else. She doesn't want to walk there. So she's going to roll her stalwart first. I guess it doesn't matter because her thing can't go down. It would have. She would have healed two stress. Um, but I guess she's just going to heal the grave robber. No real good... Divine Grace? Divine Grace? No. Not that nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a test. Get that roll out of there. <laughs> Got to get that used up. Ooh, crit. Okay, there's a crit. That gives both of them that. And she heals <clears throat> nine. But Yeah. Okay, well, we know what the last one is. So he takes last six, one his. six more damage. Yep. So we'll put a ten and a one. You got a one? I mean a ten. A ten and a ten. Yep. He's at 61 now. Okay. I think. I... And he's going to attack this space. 61. With an accuracy of 7, crit chance 1. 5. So that's 16 damage to the highwayman. <laughs> so <that's... laughs> From 3 to 19? Was that? <laughs> yeah. I get it, dude. Can you give me a 10? A 10? You don't need a 10. Oof. Ow. Owie. He's come off now. Uh-huh. 
We need to have him go first every turn. Every turn. Because that junk ain't ain't cool. Crusader's turn. Crap. All right, Crusader, what you gonna do? What you gonna two. do when the prophet comes for you? <laughs> um. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta split those two up. Um, I am going to. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, we're gonna. I'm okay moving in there. It's still the same chance. So we're going to move in there and we're going to smite three accuracy eight crit two. Nice. That's 1922 damage. Really? Yeah. And <clears throat> I don't know how many more 10s we got. 20. And go. 22 damage, yeah! That's 83. I broke the door down! <laughs> you broke half of his... I did. He looks even more busted than he did. All right. Oh, crap. I'll roll two, you can roll He loses two. four. Okay. You put a five up there? Yep. Three and five. Oh, you're just rolling two of them? Yep. You got the other two. Crap, I'm already getting hit once. Two and four. Wow, nice. Push your friends. <laughs> One. And, um. Ah. Uh, see, here's the thing. Even if he hits me, I'm just gonna go to Death Store. Mm hmm. Right? Yeah. Because I can go in there and open vein again and put another stack of bleed on him. But I don't know if that's worth it. Well, you don't want to go in there because he's looking for the most crowded room. And since you guys are in the front, this will now be the most crowded room. Got it. So his second turn will attack you and then he'll blow up a pew in the same place. Oof. Okay. Uh, good. Thank you for that explanation. I'll just do pistol shot then. <laughs> 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 Pistol shot, uh, accuracy eight, crit two. Nice. Well, so that's a hit. Nine more damage. Nine more. Are okay. we running out of tens over there? 30, 40. Oh, wait. I didn't do that right, did I? So we're at 80. How much did you say? Nine damage. So just take one off and I'll put 10 on. Okay. So he's at 90. Six. Come on. His turn. <clears throat> He's gonna attack the most crowded room. Takes four more. Okay. That puts him at a hundred. <clears throat> yep. Okay. So we'll just put that there. Yep. That's a hundred. Wow. All right. Well, he's gonna attack the most messed up room there, the fullest room. He's going to do a eye on you. Again. Again. So accuracy is 11. Crit chance 2. And that is a crit. Fart knocker. So that's one there. One there. It's five damage each. Nice. 
11 over 17. That's two stuns for... So this is another stack of two stuns. Now those are separate. So does that mean it knocks she out? She gets nothing. She gets nothing. Yeah. Wow. And then one more stress each for the attack. Yeah. Okay. Dang. There we go. This dude is nasty. There he goes. He's going to blow up the pie of the pews. So he's attacking this space. So it is a... Uh, Crit 1, accuracy, accuracy 10, 8. 8. Yep. eight. Okay. So he hits. Hit. 16 damage. 16. Damage. <laughs> Do we even have that much? There's a, there we go. Got it. I got it. I got it. I don't need all that. Um. All right. Twenty six. We're not going home. Completely whole. Hey man. Records <laughs> are checkers. Checkers right. are records. So it's her it turn. Like that. Nothing. Nothing. Vestal. Vestal's turn. I need to get out of there, don't I? <clears throat> I think you probably do, yeah. She only gets one action, though. But I don't know if I get out, and he's going to be targeted. If I don't, they're just going to keep getting ticked. I don't know. Okay. Well, these all come out. Yeah. Well, now they do. That was her whole turn. Mmm, this is close. He's tipsy. I only need 51 more. <laughs> if I can get another crit, I'll smite three. Mm -hmm. That'll put us close to halfway there. Mm -hmm. Just need to roll crits, man. That's I did what, that. That's what Whole we need to do. Half the day I did that. We need to do that. Alright, Crusader's turn. Alright, so Crusader. <clears throat> Ooh, got you where I want you. So, we're gonna do Smite 3, first of all. You got him where you want you. Um, accuracy 8, crit 2. That's nice. it. So that's 14 damage. 14? Yeah. You got a 10. Nope, I think I'm out of tens. We are out of tens. I got some fives. <clears throat> I only have three ones so we can already. We can always count. We're already 100 down, unless you want to visualize it. Um, we can do... I got fives, but we're going to... Yeah, fives We're going to run out of everything at this point. Fives is fine. What do we say? 14? Um, if you weren't borrowing his tens over there, I know. <laughs> he needs to stop. Okay. All right. So that's that. Um, and now he's immune to stun, right? Mm -hmm. But that's all I have left. Up close. Yeah. yeah. Well, no. I mean, I can do zealous accusation. Oh, it's actually more damage. It's at range. Huh? Oh, yeah. It's it's at range. Battle heal. Um, <clears throat> I just gonna do stunning blow. Okay. Everything else is at range. Uh, six, so seven, seven accuracy. So crit two. So yeah, it's just five damage. All right. Nineteen. Um, I think I'm going to use uh. Mm, I really wanted to. I really wanted to. But I you think should. I'll wait. Be. Okay. Really? Do you think I should? Why not? What's the... I'll just no heroics. Yeah. What did I just do? Huh? I just put a 10 over there, right? Yeah. So you need to get so, rid of So now I need to get rid of 9. So I can just put yeah. that in there and take this. Yep. <laughs> it still looks like I have a whole mess of damage. 
Okay, it's Highwayman's turn. Mm. The Highwayman's turn. <clears throat> Moving in. Yeah. Oh, wait, that makes it the... And it makes it the most crowded room again. It definitely will attack that room. He's going to attack that room anyways, because Crusader's in the front, but... We need to get more Blight and Bleed on him. We're slowing down. Mm-hmm. Um, because he kept hitting these two. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yep. Yeah. Pistol shot. And accuracy eight, crit two. Yeah. Ooh. Well, it's action one, you can do it again. Yeah. Pistol shot three. Okay. That's a hit. It's nine. Um ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. I actually found a 10. <clears throat> you have a 5? Yeah. Do you have a 5? Yeah. 31. 20 hit points left. 20, 31. Oh, jeez. We so should do it. It's his turn. Just depends on where those freaking pews land this turn. Alright, roll your two dice. Okay, here we go. I got two, four, six, and one. So, two go here. Mm -hmm. One goes here. Yep. And one goes on the four. four. Yep. Mm. Okay. Alright, his turn again. again. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Should have done a lot of things. Okay, so he, <laughs> so he's going to move one space to be one space away from the crowded. So where do we want him? Here? Yeah, so you can bleed him? Sure. Okay, and then he is going to attack the Crusader with... Fulminate again. So accuracy is eight, crit chance two. That's it. <clears throat> okay, so that's three damage, <clears throat> three blight for three turns. Three damage, three blight. Three turns. Okay. Red <sighs> Robbers next. She's going to poison dart. Oh, she only got she has one action, so it is gonna be poison dart. Crit chance three, accuracy nine. Come on, crit. Nope. But three damage. That's a good hit. Alright, so three damage. And he gets his blight back. Ten, twenty, thirty-four. Thirty-four. Okay, that's her turn. Vestal's turn. So the Vestal is going to. We can't stun him, right? We can't stun mm -mm. him. All right, Vestal's going to heal him up. Okay. Divine Grace, crit chance four. That's a crit. Well, before you do that, before he does. Before she does that, I need to roll the stalwart. Oh, well, that just removes the rest of my stress. Mm -hmm. So that's a crit for nine health. Nine health, okay, cool. He was nine. Oh, was he a <sighs> 19? Yes, he was. <laughs> and she's going to do a judgment against this guy. Crit two. Accuracy 7, that's a miss. Dang it. Okay, it's his turn. So he's going to attack this space. Okay. 
Crit chance 1, accuracy 10. Or accuracy 7. Accuracy 7. That is a crit for 24 damage. And I'll take 12. This is a stress. Or gains a stress, sorry. So I take 12 and I'm at death's door. Have you got a, a 5 over there? I do not. I just have a whole bunch of 1s. Okay. Well, just give me... Uh, um, you said... <laughs> yeah, just give me 5. 5 1s. Or 2 1s. It doesn't matter. And he does... He takes 4 damage from that. That's one, two, three, four, five. So he's at ten, twenty, thirty, eight. Thirty-eight. So he needs thirteen damage. Yep. And you're at death's door. Everybody's beat up. You got that blight on you. Alright, here we go. Crusaders first. Blight for three. We're gonna have to steal some of that hundred over there. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm gonna drink another potion. He needs 13 damage. He needs 10, 20, 30, 38. Smite 3. Yeah. He needs 13 damage. Smite 3. If I hit, he's dead. If you hit, oh, look at that. So accuracy if you hit, we eight. win. Accuracy 8, crit 2. All right. There it is. He's dead. He fell over. Wait, he's already laying down. Dead. <laughs> So that's 14 damage. 11 plus 3 is 14. Right on. That is a damn. We are the champions, <laughs> my <What>? friends. <laughs> I don't know. Oh. Look at that stack. Look at that stack. 11 here, 5 that there. That is something else. Death store loaded up. We used mm. almost all of our hit point markers. Now, again, this is a prototype, prototype. copy. So. Doesn't mean that one boss is gonna <laughs> overload our our components or anything like that. So don't yeah. don't go thinking wild stuff. But wow, I mean, yeah. he these nasty. things are stinking nasty, dude. Can you imagine a couple bad rolls where we hit two or three guys at once? Yeah, we'd have like two fewer heroes right now. <laughs> oh yeah, my goodness! Awesome. Highwaymen at death's door. Crusader is at 23 out of 32. Yeah, I'm 11 of 17 <clears throat> and 5 there. This was not easy. We got some good rolls, but definitely not easy. And we're not going back with a lot of money. No, we are not. We are, we, we've only got 32 bucks here. Yep. 32 bucks and 3 experience points each. And 2 levels left for the Darkest Dungeon. <sighs> 2 more I... Dungeons. I don't think we're going to... Come on, you said that. I'm just trying act, to keep it real, act man. Act two, I don't think we're going to make it. Act three, <laughs> I don't think we're going to make it. I love, I love, I love the, the very first part of one of the videos. It was like, they're, you know, the text of the video was like, they're heading back into the, into the dungeon. <laughs> My first words were, we're going to die. <laughs> Yes, I remember that. <laughs> yep. Oh, man. Good deal, uh, man. I cracked myself up. Excellent deal. This is cool, though. This is cool. It really, man, I really think that there's a bigger gap between level 3 and level 2 than there was between level 2 and level 1. I don't know because it depends on how we level up our characters in level 2. Like, we could have been maybe a little stronger. Sure. It just feels that way right now. Yeah. Because the level three monsters are just freaking they nasty. They are nasty. They're just freaking nasty. Level twos were bad, yeah, but level threes are just, oh my goodness. And then you pull three of them and uh, two of them yeah. in one room. 
Uh, anyway, very cool. Super looking forward to Darkest Dungeon and the Heart sure. of Darkness. That'll be fun. So thanks. This has been very fun. I'm Sam Healy. JT Turner. And we're going to go ahead and get on out of here. We will be heading back to the Hamlet yep. at the beginning of Level 4. Act 4. The Dark Dungeon. The Darkest Dungeon. So that's it. Thanks for joining us. We appreciate it. I hope you enjoy these videos. Come back for more after we get through recording them. See you on the flip side, folks. Have a good one. Take care. I beg you, deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon.